Hi everybody, it's Debbie, and I just wanted to do a quick video to show you a few projects I've been working on. Um, I had seen Pat S. on YouTube, um, Patricia. She had done some fabric envelopes, and she got her inspiration from Michelle Pipling. And so I just fell in love with them, so I had to try it. So this is one I came up with. I used, um, for the lining, I used the lining from the wedding dress that I bought last year and I've been cutting up. And uh, I had doilies that were rectangle and I sewed them onto the lining and sewed the actual shape of the envelope pouches and everything else is glued on with a little bit there's a couple spots where I used heat heat bond and ironed on but for the most part all the embellishments are glued on so I love this one um, while the laces and doilies that I use they come from a variety of places uh, this is an applique that I cut from the wedding dress. It was kind of boring, bland, so I sewed on, or glued on. I wasn't going to sew these on. I glued on all these sequins just to give it a little more interest. And I used seam binding here. Um, this lace and this lace under here, they're both from Amanda. And then I've got some blue lace underneath. And this is not a double lace. I actually glued two pieces of lace together to give it the fullness there and a row of flat back pearls down the center just to hide the seam. And you open it and I've got this seam binding coming up through the middle hole of the doilies. And most of the doilies a lot of the doilies that I'm using on these projects came from Juliet Thrifty Paper Garden TPG Crafts on Facebook. And then this bling I had gotten from eBay. And I've got lace along here, the seam of the eyelet, and there's teeny weeny pearl trim along the edge of the lace there. And on the back, this lace I got, this trim I got from D at Ele Elegant Embellishments. And a bunch more doilies. This came from Amanda here. Um, an oval doily and then some round ones. So this is the blue themed one. And I just love how this turned out. So that's one. And this one's sort of a brownish tannish, I guess, one. So here's another one of my wedding appliques. Some lace down here and this acrylic flower trim I got from eBay. Um, this brownish lace is from Amanda as well. More seam binding. And up here, this is from Julie. This is bow trim, was from Amanda as well. And here's some more. This one, I had tea dyed that and I just thought it worked perfect on here. And then a bunch more doilies, and these I got from eBay. I just love the look of the layering. So there's that one. And then this one is the white one, more wedding applique. Another applique here. More trims from Amanda. This pearl trim here, this is from Irene at Seriously Scrapping. Flat back pearls along here, that's from Wild Orchid Crafts. Lots more doilies. And 
and this is from Wild Orchid Crafts as well. And again, I pulled the seam binding up through the doily and covered it with a flower center that I got from eBay. And then the last one I did, this is the pink one. And another applique, and I put a little flower. This trim, I just love this trim here. I put all around the sides and across the top, and that I got from Natasha and Natasha's scrapbook corner. And put a bunch of flowers here. And trim. And this one, I didn't put a doily here. I just had the seam binding coming up from underneath these uh, trims there. And then a layer doily on the back again. So thank you so much, Patricia, for the inspiration. I just loved making these, and I think they turned out really pretty. And thanks so much for watching, everybody. Have a great day. Bye.